What happens at absolute zero temperature? Do you think you know? At the coldest possible temperature in the universe, the laws of physics get weird. It's a place where thousands of atoms can lose their identity and act as one. This is the world of absolute zero. To understand it, you have to know that heat is just the motion of atoms. The faster they move, the hotter it is. So if you could slow them down until they stop completely, you'd reach the theoretical limit of cold, absolute zero. That's zero Kelvin, or a mind-numbing minus 273.15 degrees Celsius. So why can't we just get there? The third law of thermodynamics states that reaching absolute zero is impossible. It's like a finish line that moves away every time you take a step. The reason is quantum mechanics. The Heisenberg uncertainty principle says, you can't know a particle's exact position and momentum at the same time. If an atom stopped completely at absolute zero, its momentum would be zero and its position would be exact, which violates a fundamental rule of the universe. While we can't reach absolute zero, scientists have gotten within a billionth of a degree of it. And down there, the quantum world goes macroscopic. This creates a fifth state of matter, the Bose-Einstein condensate. Here, when certain particles called bosons are cooled to near absolute zero, their individual wave-like natures overlap. They lose their identities and merge into a single superatom, where thousands of atoms behave as one single quantum object. Once you have this collective state, things get even stranger. Near absolute zero, liquid helium can become a superfluid. This is a liquid with zero viscosity, meaning it can flow without any friction. It can literally defy gravity, climbing up the walls of its container. Then there's superconductivity. When you cool certain materials to these temperatures, they lose all electrical resistance. A current started in a superconducting loop would theoretically flow forever with no power source. This journey into extreme cold isn't just about breaking records. It could lead to incredible technologies, from quantum computers to hyper-efficient power grids. Absolute zero is an impossible destination, but chasing it shows us that the universe is never truly at rest, and reality is far stranger than it appears. So what do you think is the wildest phenomenon here? The superatom the gravity-defying liquid, or the current that never ends. Let me know in the comments, and be sure to like and subscribe for more.